used to go um, straight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now I've run this into that, put some lining up. So then when I get to plaster this, at least I can get an architrave all the way around now. So uh, that's that, it looks much tidier. You know, so. Uh... Oh no, I saw you miscut that. Okay, so tell me about the floor, because there's a problem. Why, what's the problem? Okay, so what have you done with the floor here? Well, I built up the floor. Okay, so what was the at the beginning? Sorry? What was there at the beginning? Just concrete, yes? It's all uneven concrete, yeah. So what is the reason you're putting these boards on? The reason? The reason is I don't have to spend a lot of money on the self-leveling. Um, so what have you done? Explain bit by bit what have you done. Okay, so I've taken my... I, well, I know that floor is completely level. Okay, so you cemented that, that gap here. Yeah, that's gap. That's nothing. But... Um, 40, uh, I know that this floor on my spirit level gave me a measurement of 40 mil, yeah? Mm -hmm. So I've measured each section of the floor, starting from this end to 40 mil, minus a couple of mil for the south leveling, yeah? So now I know that over in there, it's going to go from nothing from that corner to two mil here. And that's all the way along. So this is the thick board, 18 mil. And where the floor is uneven, I have to drop this to um, 12 mil. And then this section was dropped to 9 mil. And this section dropped to 6 mil. So uh, 5 mil, sorry. So you have like different, uh, yeah. uh, different sizes of, yeah. with different width of exactly. the board. Exactly. So here the 12 mil drops down to 9 mil. <laughs> and here drops down to 5 mil. So this is Mike's le uh, levelling system. <laughs> no, it's not a levelling system. What, what it is, so, is... No, what it is... Well, that's not the normal way to do it. Why isn't it? What it is, is if I put my level here now, I know this floor is completely level because I built Which it. Which one? This wooden floor I put in. I this built. one, yes, okay. So I know now, I know now with my measurement, yeah, that let's say, um, let's show an example. Because you never know, people might. Uh, People might uh, want to know this. It's very DIY. No, it's not very <laughs> DIY. It's it's a principle. But oh, you can pattern that. Okay, look. That's the level floor. Yeah, just here is where the laser line hits. Yeah. So that's the laser line. That's the laser line. Yeah. yeah? So when I put it anywhere. Yeah, on this floor, it's going to always hit that line, okay. always, okay. yeah? Now, for this floor that's totally uneven, yeah. yeah, I need that laser line to be I need that laser line to sit below this line here, yeah? Why? Right? Because I need to put self leveling. Oh, I see, okay. Yeah? So the self leveling will bring it up to my laser line. Okay, so. So if I put it here, yeah? If I put it here, right? I'm below my laser line, right? That's quite a lot. Oh. No, that's okay. quite a lot, yeah? But if I move it here, yeah? Can you see it's dropped? It's getting lower. Yeah? So I have to take the happy medium, which is which is that. Can you see? I'm literally level with the floor now. So what does it mean? It means that here will be very minimal self-leveling okay. compound. Okay, so the idea is to save on self-leveling. Well, yeah, because you go around by putting these boards. 
So the self-level and the no, this is standard practice. This is, is it? Yeah, it's never seen something like that in my life. Yeah. So self-level, you go on top of it. Well, it's like this. Here you go. Let's say, for example, right, this section at twenty mil. Yeah, just this section, one square meter. Let's say that twenty mil difference. Well, to be honest, it's twenty-four. Yeah, I know that for a fact because that's eighteen mil. But there is zero. But let's say that's 24, right? I would have to pay 20 pound a bag and I probably need maybe two bags to build at that level. Okay. That's 40 quid. Okay, yeah? so it's cost saving, yes? Yeah, it's a whole Okay, cost so, so yeah. is this floor done now, yes? Ready for well, it's all level ready. Level? I mean, I've got, my, I've got my levels there. Can you see I'm just, just above that line there. So by the time I put my self level in, which is that much, yeah? It should match up with this one, yeah? yeah. Okay, so when, when you're going to do self-leveling? Well, I've not decided on how I'm going to, I, I'm thinking, I'm thinking doing it in multiple pores, yeah? So basically what I would do, or what I'm thinking about doing is, because this is the worst section, I'm thinking, Get self-leveling to this level, mm -hmm. yeah? Um, or even to this level, yeah? Just do this section first, let it dry, put another sealer coat on there. So this is the lowest? Uh, yeah, oh, this, this, this goes all over the place, yeah. So I can do it in stages. So I can bring it up to this level here, yeah? So it's level here, so that's now level with this pour. Then I can do another pour, once it's dry and I seal it again, I can do another pour to this level, yeah? So all this then gets leveled to this area. And then do a third pour, but I, I don't know if you can do that, but do a third pour, which then would take me to the level of my floor there. Okay, okay, looks, sounds like a plan.